morning guys it's not even morning it is 12 o'clock i just woke up my hair is a wreck because i went to sleep on it wet last night so there's like volume for days so the other day when i didn't vlog i broke my phone again first i broke it in hawaii now i broke it again if you can see hold on let me try and turn the brightness up you can see it's like the screen just keeps doing things on its own like i don't even touch it the lcd is broken it's just super glitchy if you can see at the bottom it's like all glitchy and it's like replicating the top it's really weird it's, it's just like doing weird things it's so weird so i am heading to the apple store here in a little bit i just want to put on a little bit of makeup and i'm gonna be over in the santa monica area anyway see if i can find an outfit for beauty con while i'm there and get my phone fixed and then I have to write a paper today. I have a paper due on the 7th, which is so annoying. It's the 5th today, which is also my mom's birthday. I need to text her. Uh, I just want to discuss really quickly my video that recently went out on my main channel. Um, a very emotional, weird one. A lot of people were so supportive of that video. Like, I cannot believe the amount of messages and comments and text messages I got from people everywhere, old friends, new friends, YouTube friends, subscribers, people like that I've talked to maybe once, like just feeling like they needed to text me. Like the amount of support is unreal. And like for a while, just yesterday, two days ago, I was extremely regretting uploading that video. I was like thinking like, why did I do that? Why did I like, you know, expose myself emotionally on camera like that? And why did I, I guess, I don't know, truly let people know how I feel because I feel like it's going to really impact my channel in the future and what people's thoughts are of me. But then I started thinking, I was like, the amount of hate that I've gotten versus the amount of love I've gotten on that video is just like uncomparable. Like the, it's like 95, 90% love and like 5, 10% hate. So there's, I just can't look at only hate on that video. So I don't regret it now, but I was two days ago or yesterday. I was like, oh man, I shouldn't have posted that. And like was thinking of privating it, but I was like, no, like this video is helping people for some reason. Like people were texting me being like, thank you so much. I was like, what? So I don't regret it. Um, but I just want to say thank you guys for all your support. It's been amazing. So I, I, I've been trying to read every message and I just can't because there's so many supportive things. So thank you guys so much. Um, another thing is like, I feel like people were saying they were unsubscribing and blah, 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 because they're like, I don't want to see more videos like this. I don't want to see only Christian content. I don't want to see more of what you have to post. If you guys could do me a favor and on my next videos or on that video, just spread the word that like, I'm not only going to be posting Christian content. I'm not only going to be posting deep, mopey sad videos that's not my point my point is that i want to post videos more like 50 things you don't know about me like things that you can truly get to know about me or things that i like like advice for certain topics or story times or things that have happened to me that have made me better or have made me worse but or how i gained experience from it things like that not just oh i'm a christian jesus is awesome like yes jesus is awesome but like i don't want to be doing only mopey sad videos. So I know this video is getting really drawn out, but if you guys could do me a favor and just let people know that my videos aren't only gonna be sad, they're not only gonna be mopey, I'm still gonna be doing fun videos, I'm still gonna be doing bubble videos, but I don't think I wanna do all the time necessarily like life hacks or morning routines. I wanna do something a little bit more different. Um, I wanna get a little bit more creative on my channel and I'm not totally sure what that means just yet, but I wanna be thinking about it and I wanna try and do it. So don't still be surprised if there are still some fun little girly fun videos. I just said fun twice, but whatever. <laughs> but I'm gonna be trying to think of ways to incorporate different, more creative videos on my channel. So that's all I'm gonna say about that. I know that was really long. Um, I did need to say that though, so I hope you guys enjoy that and can respect that and spread the word. I love you guys. And I'm gonna go to the Apple store and get my phone fixed. Hello guys, I just got out of my Uber and basically I accidentally ordered an Uber Black because my phone is so messed up and my screen that I couldn't see. Oh crap, that would happen to me. Awesome, love life. 
Um, so I couldn't see what I, ooh, I was ordering and he pulls up in that like black Suburban and I was like, that is not the car. And I like looked at the license plate and I was like, oh my gosh, it is. And I was like, um, I didn't mean to order an Uber black cause like they're super expensive. And I just was like, oh, screw it. Cause I had one free Uber ride up to like $25. So like, I think that's going to cover a majority of it. And I just need to get my phone fixed. So I'm here about to get my phone fixed y'all. So I'm at Brandy Melville now. I'm about to try on a bunch of stuff. getting a whole entire pizza but it's really just two slices <laughs> it's two like beautiful like golden retrievers came up today has been crazy so you know how i said i couldn't catch an uber i literally was waiting for a taxi to get one couldn't get one so i literally once this guy finished his lift drive i just stopped him and i was like sir i really really need help i was like i don't know how to get to the next apple store i have no way of like making my phone work and i was like is there any way you can just drive me and he's like well do you have cash and i was like no but i can go to the atm so he dropped me off at an atm i got him money and this sweet man drove me to the next apple store and saved my life today has been so stressful but today i mean honestly god has been helping me out so much so now i'm here at apple I'm about to get my next phone. <laughs> so I am at Cent what is I don't even know where I am because I just went to the Apple store. I think it's called something Century Center City. I can't I honestly don't know. Um got my new phone guys. Brand new phone, thank God. The amount of stuff I've gone through today to get this phone is unreal. But like I did it. I got a phone. <laughs> I'm alive. I changed my shirt. I mean man. Today's been so crazy, but like, I know God's got me. I'm just chilling here for a second because I've been running around all day, and I'm also kind of waiting for traffic to die down now. So it's 5.30 right now, so I'm just gonna chill here for a little bit until traffic dies down and I can go home. <laughs> okay guys, back home. I guess this is kind of home. Um, let me show you, sorry. <laughs> let me show you a mini haul. So, first I went to CVS. And this is what I got. Shaving cream, shavers, toothpaste, and since I'm out in the sun a lot, sunscreen, and my favorite mascara, the Lash Sensational. Here's what I got from the store, or from shopping today. Zara shirt, another Zara shirt. Brandy Melville off the shoulder, kind of crop top, black shorts. Another black off the shoulder shirt and a gold necklace. Okay guys, so I have to write a paper unfortunately, but I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching today's vlog. Hope you guys enjoyed my explanation, seeing me on this crazy day. Update, you know what makes me so mad? There was an AT&T store within walking distance to me and I could have just gone there to fix my phone and have avoided all the problems I went through today. And I didn't know that. Kill me. But either way, I got the phone. I got a new one. It's all back to normal. Everything is good to go. So thank you guys for watching today's vlog. I love you. And I will hopefully see you very soon. Peace out, Girl Scout. Bye.